Deerman in the back. Let's see this one from the side over here. One of these in Wilmington at the airport there. Of course, it's not quite as polished as this one. George remembers when uh, Wilbur was up in this <laughs> thing. <laughs> and Jimmy, this is a Stearman? Everybody My dad had these? one when I was a kid, and I used to fly in it. With it has it. the smaller engine because it doesn't have the cowling on it. Yep. Many of these were converted to crop dusters in Southern California. Yeah. Uh, what is this, a Skyline? I don't consider that old. Okay, so it's an AT-12. It's got a three-bladed prop. Yep, that's the now, This is more my style, Jimmy, because it's not quite as new. Yeah, there you go. Not quite as modern. No. I like the older stuff, the canvas wings. And then, uh, look at that, it looks like hammered out cowling. <laughs> Beautiful yes, wood front. Yes, it's a little bit crude. Held together with French cord. It's a French plane. All right, stepping over here. Look at all kinds of stuff in here. Looks like a little Aranka. Army observation plane from World War II. Yep. It's a, um, I can't remember. They made a lot of racing planes out of them. It had the engine in behind the pipe. Another steer? See that plane, the tri that, this one in the center right here? Tricycle gear, you mean? Yeah, it's a... Um, I can't remember. They made a lot of racing planes out of them. It had the engine in behind the pilot. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see the air. Uh, yeah. Wait, they, they were supposed to be as good as the P-51 Mustangs, but they never would. Were. Huh. This, what's this, a PT-22 or something like that? This thing? Yeah. It's like a Russian plane, right? It's like a Russian plane. Huh? Well, look at that emblem. The red star. Oh, yeah. Here's a better shot of it here. This one's going through restoration, a little engine work. Yep. I'm oh, sorry. This is a replica of inside the USS Enterprise of the hangar bay. This is interesting, this little piece of aluminum or steel or whatever yeah. it is. That's a piece of the kamikaze plane that dove in on the Enterprise. Oh, okay. That's not an Akifab port, is it? No. <laughs> not an Akifab, okay. Just check. Boy, it has some nicely restored stuff. Oh, yeah. 
all that lead coming at you? In the middle of it all? Okay, I just wanted to double check. Now we're in the restoration hangar, is that what this is? This is restoration. Yep. Planes are undergoing restoration. There's all kinds of projects going on in here. Yeah, this thing's looking good over here. Hold on. You're on the flying wing over here. I'm coming. Oh, jeez. Were they drones? I think that they must have been. There's a jet drone there. All kinds of stuff on the walls. Back walls too. Holy mackerel. You got some of that. This plane over here was one of the first jet aircraft ever built in America. Oh, no kidding. First American built jet powered fighter plane to interactive service. Oh, wow. I'm looking straight over there. I'm looking at a Navy on. See it? Yes, sir. You're right. Now, what's this? Is this one of the ones we saw outside the Russian jobs before a couple of years ago or not? Uh, you know what? It's not that dissimilar, is it? But it's not the same plane. It's definitely, got a, it's definitely big for a single, isn't it? Yeah. And it's uh, it's like an airline. <laughs> Cause you got the yeah. pilot yeah. stuff up there, and then yeah, seat stuff the down the lower part. Actually, it, is an air it does have passenger seating. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, and you know what? You might be right because it's got a big red star on the back. Maybe it is a Russian plane. Remember we saw a big yellow yes, one like that at that, that one and up. Yep. Hmm. We're looking at a. Uh, Outlaw 10-5 motor, right? I think so, yeah. This is uh, not AccuFab powered. does have a big centrifugal blower. And a very large carburetor. 